Hi leaders, Will Davis Jr. here with an invitation for you to participate in our fall small group and teaching series that I'm tentatively calling to the Saints in Austin. It'll probably be renamed something else by the time I get back, but it's probably right now to the Saints in Austin, to the Holy Ones, the Hagias in Austin. It's about holiness. Now, rather than being this lofty, ethereal, woo topic that holiness may sound like on the surface, that only God can relate to, it is actually a very personal, relevant topic for today that really gets down to, in fact, the scripture says, you be holy as I'm holy. Well, holiness meant that you're separate, that you're distinct, that you're set apart, that you're not like anything else, that you don't blend, and that you don't blend in. It gets down to what you talk about. It gets down to how you spend your money. It gets down to how you treat your spouse and your neighbors and your enemies and your coworkers. It gets down to what comes out of your mouth. It gets down to what you watch and what you intake into your brain and the kind of music you listen to and what you read. It gets down to not looking like the world. And it's really a relevant topic, given the blending of our world that's going on, church and non-church, this may not be a more relevant topic on the planet than holiness. The scripture says, do everything you can to live at peace with all men and to pursue holiness without which no one can see the Lord. We are to pursue holiness. So we'll be talking about it starting September 17th and going really to the end of October. We have a team in place to write curriculum for you uh, that's based on the messages that I give on Sundays. It's going to be really relevant and really practical and really easy to lead. And I'm asking you, I'm asking you to participate. Back in the many, many years ago, over a couple decades ago, probably we used to do uh, required small group studies. We called them IVs, intravenous studies, where we'd inject into our church body this truth for all people. We do it twice a year. We require a curriculum for four weeks on evangelism or on missions, or on stewardship, or whatever, because we wanted everybody to get it. We don't do that anymore, but if we were going to do it, it'd be on this topic. Like, we want everybody talking about holiness, because the bar is so high, be holy as I am holy. And it really seems that we've slipped so far. The gap is pretty great, and this is going to be really a potential for God to bring yet continued awakening and stirring to our church through this study. So it begins September 17th. I'm hoping you'll participate. Lead your group to it. Start praying about it now. And I'll see you in September. I can't wait. Buckle up. God's going to bless us. See you soon.